Nerickson's unique workflow creates one millimeter pixel resolution digital baseline models of large concrete infrastructure. By applying machine learning algorithms that recognize cracks and spalls in concrete, thousands of optical images are automatically mapped for a complete, quantified, and spatially accurate view of the asset's structural health. Defect layers can be visualized within the AutoSpecs platform, complete with unique attributes that provide the dimensions of the defect, such as crack length and width, along with a unique ID for easy tracking. This crack map contains tens of thousands of cracks, each with quantified information that could be symbolized based on crack length or width. In this case, the green cracks refer to widths between zero and three millimeters and yellow between three and five millimeters. Cracks and spalls can also be visualized using the spatial density layer, which displays the areas of lower and higher rates of defects for easier viewing and monitoring. The slide bar allows the user to set a threshold depending on the crack density of interest. For example, this area in red indicates an area of higher crack density as measured in cracks per square meter, compared to the neighboring area without red that has a lower crack density. Other important superficial features are mapped as well, including efflorescence and vegetation, both of which can be important indicators of seepage or areas that require maintenance in the near future. These yellow polygons outline areas of efflorescence along with a unique ID. These purple polygons outline areas of vegetation growth. In addition to the defects which are projected on an orthomosaic, Nierickson builds a complete 3D digital twin of the structure at one millimeter pixel resolution. This gives a view of the entire structure while providing information related to 3D geometry of the defects, such as depth of large spalls and major structural cracks, such as those seen on these piers. Back in AutoSpecs, we can turn on another defect layer to see the mapped extent of spalls along with the quantified surface areas as highlighted by these blue polygons. Our in-house acoustic sensor device acts as a flying hammer test, providing information regarding delamination in the shallow subsurface of the concrete. These point measurements can be contoured to highlight areas of delamination, as seen in red, and areas of sound concrete, as seen in green. Thermal data provides unique insight regarding areas of temperature contrast, such as sea pitch spots and pockets of air behind the surface that cools at a different rate and may be indicative of delamination. A thermal map for an entire gravity dam is seen here. 